Alright, so today, we're going to be trying out the Hero Mid-Rose deck that I was kind of making a little bit. And, you know, um, just trying to see, like, how good it really is. Uh, thank you, Trial, for the rate of 24. <laughs> we're just starting right now. Um, so we're just going to be trying to optimize this deck a little bit. Basically, the idea is that we're trying to, you know, fix the issue of Rose really having this huge Mungus issue of just, you know, on turn 2, there's a 1-drop and a Plumber, and it just removes your entire turn 2 play from existence, because Rose has enough, Rose has nothing, you know, that has more than 2 health, when, you know, it's below, it's two, when it costs 2 or less, because nothing has more than, nothing has 3 health or more that costs 2 mana for Rose. So that's a huge problem in itself for Rose, because then it's just really easy to exploit, as I really previously explained uh, in the Best Decks for 2021 kind of, you know, video, where I explained why, you know, kind of, Rose is not a like, good hero because it dies to Plumber very easily on turn 2. You know, give, like, it's guaranteed, you know, tempo value for your opponent if they just, you know, hold the Plumber in your hand. And so we're trying to fix that problem by basically just running a lot of, you know, uh, anti-Plumbers. Um, basically, we're running Primal Sunflower on turn 1 to basically skip the, you know, 2 drops because nothing there has wanted free health. But then on the free drop slot, we have the uh, Rescue Radish and the Catch a Mechanic, which do happen to usually have more than free health, and it's similar to with Pepper MD because you know Pepper because if you're ignoring the turn one, then Pepper Buddy activates more often, as well as already having really good support uh, in Rose originally. So that's kind of a legit use of you know Pepper MD because then we can also reuse our buddies with our radishes. So it's kind of like maximizing our radish synergy right here because we can play radish in turn three as well when you have Primal Sunflower up already. So we can get a free four by turn two, which is pretty good, um, and we can also bounce a either of these one. One drops and zero drops right here, so we've got lots of targets for rescue radish, which I really like. Um, so kind of for the late game, I'm running four cop cannons right here, and that's why I really, I really want to run like four, four kernels and four little bunnies just to be able to maximize our, you know, anti, you know, kind of, um, big minions because we're not running ice spore anymore, so we kind of just need relying on these cop cannons, and these cop cannons are usually not interrupted by, by like removal lines like fruitcake because then you can just in instantly remove a minion off the board, which I kind of like to have the cop cannons for. So that's kind of why I'm like running four off because you know this is kind of like the most anti you know plumber lines that we have right here. So I'm kind of running a couple of copies of brain Anna just to try to see like how good it is it really with this strike for minions because i've heard some other people that are saying that you know they play astro cut on turn five brain out on turn six is pretty good because then it protects your astro cut from being removed in turn re like immediately so you can get 10 damage to face which i think might be legit but i have to see if like it's really that great uh might end up cutting brain anus for something else i don't know but we're just trying to fill the late game slot right here just kind of the anti fruitcake cards that you know really need to get that final blow in i'm gonna play brain anna i don't know how good it is i kept running a couple of gray flicks um kind of found out that cool bean was not a great you know anti-grave counter because it really just froze them and didn't really do anything so i'm just running two copies of gray flicks instead of just running cool bean as a whole in this free drop slot because i'm kind of thinking like you really kind of need more than just a cool bean like you kind of need to do more than just freezing a pogo or freezing a crowd yeti because you really have to get that you know thing off the board so i'm kind of just running a couple of grave flicks and we have cough cannon right here which is also pretty against the grave against the gravestone stuff uh if they're out of the graves and it's on mug so we're kind of just you know testing this deck and see how well it does uh hopefully it does well um because i haven't really tested this deck yet but i'll be seeing you know keeping track of really what's working and what's really not and yeah so notable exclusions are like Haunted Pumpkin. We're not really hunting Haunted Pumpkin anymore because I don't like it anymore. Uh, Haunted Pumpkin is just kind of monkey s because then because the games usually go late with Rose. So you know, kind of go for Haunted Pumpkin is kind of bad because you know it just gives your opponent steam and usually froze and usually just dies the pulver anyway. So it doesn't really get any value. Just kind of running you know Colonel Pulp because it actually you know gets value before it gets plumbered anyways. <laughs> so we're just kind of like and it also synergizes with Radish more. So yeah, kind of like that. So we're not going to keep it um, first against PBS. Uh, this is a pretty good line right here, uh, to do, like, Primal Sunflower into this, it is legit, so I'm gonna go for this right here, um, yeah, so, typically speaking, this is a horrible matchup, um, so, if he has Teleportation Zombie, then we're kinda screwed, um, but hopefully he plays under minion, like, Aerobic Constructor, which would be very good for us. So you can play our things right here. Predictions? Oh yeah, guys, um, we're gonna be doing predictions right here, as per usual, um, oh, we got... Pepper MD, which is actually pretty good right here. So we're gonna probably use Pepper MD and then do a little Goatify. Um, possibly. 
Okay, what do I do here? So I think just go to find a good play right here. Do I go Pepper MD yet? Not necessarily, but I think go to find is always a pretty okay player here. Just, you know, minimize the damage we're going to take right here. Uh, because they don't really have a good answer right now. So the question is, do I go Pepper MD right here? I mean, he's probably going for Plumber. He might be going for Dancers. This is probably a good play. Um, let's do a prediction right here. So, how many wins out of 10 right here are we going to get? Um... Uh, so he does plumber and he does that. Okay, that's fine. So, so that's fine. You he was out of a plumber. That's completely fine. All this leaving me. Uh, no, I actually need to turn on my volume a little bit. I think. Okay, there you go. Yeah, I'm pretty fine with that. So he's actually running brainstorm right here. So I'm kind of happy I kept my <laughs> catch a mechanic to not play last turn because this is now going to be very very thick. Um. Or do we wait until next turn? We can do Elderberry right now and just catch up later. Have an answer to this, I guess. We can be pretty greedy. We can be pretty greedy and just do this right here. I mean, he has zero break. Okay, I'm gonna go for it, actually. Unless it's... I don't know. What can this really become? Like, Toxic Waste? Then Toxic Waste would be the most punishing right here. Or like, Tennis Champ, maybe? Okay, it's, it's a Science card. Okay, so you get Electrician. That's nice, okay. So, I think what I'm going to do right here, I'm just going to wait for my, you know, kind of, um, like, Transmog right here. And just try to remove that, like, unlife next turn. Uh, hopefully get Transmog right here. Ah, Freeze is fine, we just Freeze this. Um, lots of ads coming in, so we're going to do, um, the first ad ready. Yeah, first ad coming in right here. <laughs> we're doing ads, we have 17 ads, 17 ads to go. Probably though, from the last stream. <laughs> Thanks to you guys. Alright, uh, so we're doing you. Yeah. So we're just gonna do you right here. We can actually repeatedly use this as well, which is pretty cool. Like, you might go for, like, leap right here, so I'm gonna do this right here. Just wanna try to minimize the damage we're trying to take. Uh, I'm just gonna predict he's gonna go deep right here. So yeah, do that. Yep, there you go. Leap station. As predicted, because it's Professor Brainstorm. It's a fry deck. Um, so yeah, very nice, you know, anti play right there. So now we're actually looking pretty good. How do these ads work? Uh, I just do the commercial, and then you have to see him <laughs> if you don't have an ad blocker. So that was a really good you know, anti-play here, honestly. If I if I were to you know make it rough estimate, so brain vendor right here, that's completely fine. I'm just gonna protect it again. Um, so I'm gonna per probably do this right here, or we can just do you and then just kill this. Do we really need to heal right now? Yo, thank you. Lancer Asteroid Fall. Um. Well. I can kill this because it's gonna leap. Well, but this is gonna be more dangerous later, anyways. Alright, let's do this. So let's try to. Preserve a Cobb Cannon for next turn, I guess. Like, he's not gonna. Dance off here, right? <laughs> he's not gonna dance off here. Oh, wait, well, he uh, can't do dance off. Well, beam me up. Yeah, beam me up. Come on, be fine. That's, that's fine, because we're, I'm just trying to preserve, like, a Cobb Cannon, you know, kind of evolution play right here for next turn. You know, just to secure the win right here. So we're looking really good right here. Right. So we're looking like we're going to be winning right here. Um, just... Yeah. So we actually have an answer to both Gravestones and Minions right here, which is pretty cool. Nice, and just can see, he didn't have an answer in Elderberry anyways. So that's what I know for us. But that's kind of why you need to run Fruitcake. I, I know Fry doesn't like running Fruitcake, but you just have to run Fruitcake, you know, as removal. Um, we got a third deck. <coughs> Fruitcake's just good, sorry. Your stream is lagging? Uh, that's really, it's not really a stream, it's my stream right here. On my end, I'm really lagging right here. <coughs> it's telling me I'm getting a little bit of frame drops. Um, so yeah. It's not your problem, it's my problem. But I do see that my, you know, things are, my, my, you know, internet connection is, like, speeding up again. But it's still sitting at, like, very slow, I don't know. Today's internet connection is a bit really slow, so I don't know what the heck is going on. Um, but yeah, we're still fine. Uh, let's mulligan this right here. Okay, probably mulligan this right here. Stuff for one drops, nice. Okay. This is probably fine. Okay, this is good against the brain cell, right? So I'm gonna do this right here. Nice, we have that already. You don't need this. Alright, that's fine. Respect that. Mm 
Rampant Heroes is good into aggro pirates and tell limbs. I don't think that's a great reason to <laughs> really use it, honestly, because who the hell cares about tell limbs when you're just gonna buy in it? <laughs> like, why are why would I run Rose to Suzuki tell limbs when I'm just gonna ban tell limbs anyways, you know? Space time, yeah, typical ladder player. Nice Colonel Volt Valley, let's go. Horts is also good into elusives. Yeah, I. <laughs> yeah, bet. <laughs> Damn, okay, I kind of need him to put my phaser here because I actually got this right here, which is pretty cool. You know? I take it, I take it. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Guys, guys, look. I just have to run Black Hole my deck and then Black Hole to counter elusives. I run Gladiator instead of, you know, to counter Psygro. And then I run, like, I don't know. What else do I run? Like. <laughs> I don't know. This, this, literally, not a, it's not an argument to say a deck is good because it beats free decks, you know? It beats free decks, yeah, sure. Like, any any deck with free tech cards can just beat free decks. Like, great. <laughs> Ain't a good argument. <laughs> just, just the deck beating free decks is not good enough, dude. Like, I can just run free tech cards and I can beat, like, free decks already easily. Like great, I just need, I need to win against Lucifer. Just shove in Black Hole. I need to win against Iger. Shove in, shove in like you know, shove in the what do you call it, Gladiator. Why is he doing damage to me, dude? He knows we're running. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. So he uses that. Horse should be moved up. No, <laughs> no, <laughs> just no, bro. <laughs> okay, that's fine, that's fine. It's respectable, a respectable play right here. Radish is kind of monka. I don't know how to think about radish right here. Like, do we go elderberry or do we go radish? Like, radish is gonna break our hand for the rest of the game. I don't use it right now. But elderberry is also a lot of good value right here because we already know he doesn't have super brain sig. I mean, this is kind of safe unless he got rocket science with this thing, right? I mean, yeah. <laughs> I mean, if you get rocket science from this, this is, no, this is such garbage, I don't care. If if he really got rocket science from this, this is going to be such garbage. This is going to be such garbage if we got freaking rocket science, just watch this. What, you're thinking? He has a play right here? What, frosty mustache? Oh, great. Okay, he actually got something that saves him, of course, you know, he gets area 22. Played around that. Okay, nice. Obviously, he had to play around that. He got Area 22. <laughs> Rocket, please. Yeah, right. Um, I don't know what the heck this is. This is probably a drone engineer, actually. Um, if it's a teleportation zombie, we can kill it with this, so I'm gonna do catch up here. So, yeah. <laughs> Tomb Razor? Really overestimating this guy right now. <laughs> Overestimating this guy right now by a lot. Okay. Okay, I kinda need my team ups right here. He passes. Okay. I guess I'm just gonna try to go for. Um. What is he going for here? He's teleporting something in here? In that case, I kinda don't wanna play my things yet, right? Like, kind of don't want to play my things yet. Like, I kind of want to do, like, you. And then, you, I guess. Oh, I guess I should have killed lane 4 right there. I'm going to trade this up anyways to open up a lane. What did Rose use to be crazy? Spray Nana. I don't know. Spray Nana. Dark Matter. That's about it. And this deck, I guess. The heal package. I found heal package is okay. Yeah, okay. He's gonna teleport something there, like a beam me up. Okay. Deadly barrel. <sighs> yikes. Bunker yikes right here. Deadly barrel. It's actually pretty good. Um, why would you deadly that one that dies? <laughs> Complete fail. Yeah, deadly ain't the one that dies. I don't know what the heck he's doing. Nice, I actually hit with a 4 right here, so now it does need like another Astrocado to hit. We need a proc block first. 
Where's the first problem? Okay, yo, thank you. El Galifantula is what I follow. Um, so we're gonna do... This usually gets blocked, it's fine. Or we can do a little bit greedy right here. Or we can be... We can be, be greedy right here. Or we can go for lethal. He already used Super Brain Super. So, I mean... Chances of us being rocket science. But this might make you hop back this game and rolls a 1. Eh, probably still better. Eh, this is fine. Yo, ban, 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 ban. Yo, it's a ban. Yeah, that's a ban. Oh no, whoops, but it's not, it's not, it's not this girl, I see CH. Yo, that's a ban. What the heck is it? Skeks is connected. Just can't count this as a win. Yeah, it, like, like, you get banned, but you can put a ban, like, ban appeal if you want to. But that's just right up un unacceptable. Anyways, 2-0. Oh. <laughs> you should play Roblox. I already do play Roblox like a couple of years ago, but I mean, it's not the appropriate time to tell me that, you know? It's not the appropriate time to just spend like, span like 20 lines in a chat. So yeah, that's a ban. Using Rose deserves a ban. I mean, Yo Yo deserves a ban for running Rose in, pa like, in Pantheon. Yo Yo, I know you're watching this right now. Just, why, why Why did you pick Rose? Why did you pick Rose? Okay? Dance me. I pay ya. <laughs> Smash, okay. Brain Anna. Huh, Brain Anna is not that useful in the Smash. I'm going for a little bit of like this and this, I guess. This is kind of not that great. This is, so, this is interesting. I, I don't think I'm keeping this right here. Damn. Um, yeah, let's not keep this then. Let's try to look for something. Okay, great. <laughs> this is great. I need some, I need some late game. Got like 11 late game cards. How many late game cards do we have? Like 7, like, we have 14. <laughs> like almost half the deck is late game right here. Oh man. No ban appeal on Braffin. We're gonna open 2k accounts. R yo, real? Okay, what? Wow, just, sm he smashed like the, what? what? Wow, smash like primal sunflower. So much value. <laughs> so much value. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's looking spicy. Uh, yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, guys, this is gonna be so valued. Look at this. Look, he given it on turn two. Now we're gonna punish the heck out of him. He does that. So now we're gonna do this and. Oh, this is so great. We're gonna do Little Buddy and, you know, Bradish right here. Oh, we've been getting some value out of this. Let's go. Let's go. Um, we can balance right here. It's fine. We can balance this off the board as well if we want to. Like, what is this gonna be? Like, what is this gonna be? You know? Let's think about this. Like, are we gonna have another opportunity to really do our great flick right here? And we're not gonna- This is not getting removed off the board either, because he only has one brain maximum right here, right? He's ready he's mass 6. I'm just gonna do this right here. Let's just take the opportunity while we can. Uh, while we still can, you know, do that. Plus, we get hurt a little bit more in here, which is great. So yeah, we can do this again. This, this is amazing. <laughs> this is going great. I'm just saying that much. So it was a two brain. There. So it was, it was a two brain gravestone right here. We can just like radishes, put it down again. Oh, we have another one. Oh, we're, we, this is about to get some. This is about to get nuts right here, folks. So we can do this and heal again. This is a six six already. Let's go. Not to very No one cares. What is he gonna do? It's a sex sick. What the heck is Smash gonna do against us? What, Locust Swarm? Wow, so fast, guys. If he Locust Swarms it, he's still got these two radishes do over here. Oh, this is so valley right here. Oh, stop. Wow, guys, just stomp it. Guys, stomp it on. Stomp it on. Be best card in the game. Don't even worry about it. See ya. <laughs> bye bye, stomp it on. Okay, so now we're just gonna do this. Um, so, yeah, let's just, uh, yeah, man, let's not kill that, 
Nah, it's a bad idea. Let's just do a little bit of this. Nah, we do, we do, we do a little bit of trolling. It's called we do a little bit of trolling, right? Just just a, just a little bit more. Just a little bit more, you know? Just let, let it hit again, you know? Let's just, let's just you know, let it hit again. It's fine, guys. We're going to get next turn. <laughs> this is not fair. What is going on, folks? Dude, do I even weave like this? Well, it's pretty sleeveful for my smack, for my cob, so I'm going to go for it. Yeah, this crazy boy here, so I'm just gonna go for it. How is this even close to being fair? What is this board? Look at what we're coming in into turn six with. This, this is our board. <laughs> this is our board. Like great buffer and your minions. Oh, heal, nice, great, bro. Great play, bro. Nice play. <laughs> Probably should have this two right here, just because you know this can actually just go to lethal. But who cares? <laughs> Usually win anyways. We got like we got cop this turn, and we got this and cop again next turn. Like oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> And goodbye, dolphin. I hate dolphins. Okay, no, no, no. Oh my gosh. <laughs> to come out all context. <laughs> FPS sucks though. No, we're sending a pretty FPS right now. We're fine. The stream's like one pixel per second, dude. What? Yo, what? Yo. <laughs> Range is dropping like. Okay. Okay, it's like really dying right now. What the heck? Okay, I'll restart the stream like um like after this game. Yeah. Let me restart the stream after this game right here. Yo, this is Hellamonka. Hellamonka. Okay, this is for you know. Um, I'll restart the stream after I restart my things right here next. Okay, I'll restart the. Alright guys, um, let's just keep playing. You guys can watch one FPS stream, but YouTube video is going to be full quality. Because I'm recording on my computer now. Usually I just download it from uh, Twitch, so, you know. Yeah, let's see what happens here. So we're going HG, so typically a very, very good matchup. Um, Rose versus HG, typically a very good matchup. Uh, let's see what's going on here. So nice, you got a lot of strike crews, so we don't need this much strike crew. Um, kind of need something else other than just strike crew right here, I guess. I'll just do this hand. Okay, so iron border on one. Actually, I'm just gonna call for go to fire right here. Let's make up one one charger. I'm not gonna have an answer. I'm not gonna have an answer necessarily for like next couple of turns right here. If you see my hand, like I'm not, I'm not gonna definitely top like a radish right here. So, yeah, I'm gonna go to fire just on the spot right there. I think that's like optimal enough right there. Um, so. Yeah, okay, nice. So, it's Talons. So, see you later, TPZ. Very nice. So, it looks like it's gonna be Talons right here. So, went for the Char 2 Teleportation Zombie, huh? Um, so, yeah, this is fine. I'm just gonna... Oh, he passed right here? He's going for, like, backer bounce. We can backer bounce, so it's like, whatever, bro. <laughs> backer bounce like this. Oh, it's gonna be YKM kind of monka stuff right here. So... We have five brains to do to Astrocado, which is nice. Um, don't have enough for Brain Anna, which I would have loved to hear. Okay, here comes Hyrule, Hyrule City. Ah, everyone loves Hyrule City, eh? I mean, you just gotta love the Hyrule City, right? Uh, here comes BMR <laughs> on turn freaking, what do you call it? Turn five, turn four? It's turn four BMR, let's go. No, it's gonna be Teleportation Zombie again, so I'm just gonna kill this right here. I'm, I don't want to kill this thing in here. 
even though this does more damage, it's gonna open up a lane right here. Nice, so it's just like the teleportation zombie out of existence. Bit of noise, I'll take it. Let's see if it's like, I don't know, gondola. Usually it gets blocked, actually. If it's like gondol, you know, maybe undying pharaoh. So, yeah. Cowboy. So, Cowboy gets blocked here 100% of the time, so it's not going to move to more than once right here. So, it should be fine. Unfortunately, he did roll double freeze right here, which is kind of Monka as well. We're going to do this. Yeah, because we're not going to have enough mana to do Brain Anna and that as well. So, yeah, I kind of wanted to have the option to get between like Brain Anna and, you know, Weed Wag and stuff like that, you know? So, if he passes, then we have a great play. Okay, so he does that. Let's get a Brain Anna. What, what else is this going to be, like... What else can this be, like, Cryo Yeti? Like, what is he placing here? Like, maybe... It's probably Pogo, right? No, it's actually probably Pogo right here. Which means I probably should save my Brain Anna. Let's go for, like, this right here. Well, I kind of want this here, because in case it's going to be Cryo Yeti, right? Yeah. So, in case it's Cryo Yeti, let's do, like, this, I guess. You can't see anything. This is kind of unfortunate. Oh, it's Teleportation Zombie again. Monk ass, okay. Um, that's not gonna be that much damage. It's only six. Yeah, it's fine. Like blurf lunge. Yeah, it's fine. It's twelve damage, but we got we got brain endings turn. Hopefully he doesn't get ice moon right here. If he gets ice moon, it's game over. Noise, okay, so we're fine. So we're fine. We have this. That's fine. In fact, if he passes, actually we win if he passes, right? No, we win. no, we just win if he passes actually. Or do we? No, 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 we don't, but we have two brain nanas right here. Please pass. Come on. Pass, 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 pass. Come on. Pass. Please pass. Oh, come on. Oh, please pass. Oh. The brain nana. The brain nana value. This is amazing. This brain nana value. Let's go. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Let's go. So, nice brain nana. I like it. Okay, he rolled over freeze though, which I'm not comfortable at all because he's gonna like ice moon and stuff like that. It's not oh cop cannon, huh? Oh, he passes again. <laughs> and yeah, Brandon again. See ya, bye bye, bro, bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. And we just win. <laughs> Gotta love the double brain out of Inquisition. Four no. The double brain out of Inquisition. Incredible. Yeah, unfortunately the stream is kind of monk as right now. But anyways. <laughs> apparently people are still watching for some reason. I don't know. We got yes, you got thing of one FPS. Nice screenshot. <laughs> nice screenshot. I think you guys can still hear me though, right? No, you guys can still hear me like completely fine, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, apparently certain guys can still hear me completely fine. Um so yeah, oh, this looks okay. This looks okay. This looks okay. Let's go for it. Guys, just say one in chat, you know, if you can hear me properly right now. You know, just hear my sound like completely and just not my sound is not cutting off. Okay. So we've got a couple of scenarios over here. My, so, this is usually a sumo, but it might be Ras because this guy's rank 41, right? It might be Ras because this guy's low ranked. Actually, no. Season just reset, right? Okay, so this is a sumo, right? So, if this is a sumo, then we can be greedy. You know? Like, we can be greedy if this is a sumo, right? If it's not a sumo, then what happens? We trade the Pi Pipers of. We trade the Pi Piper for that. And then, well, I guess it's, it's always a fine play. I guess it's always a fine play, right? Nice. Playing around in sumo very nicely. Okay, great. Now this uh, game audio is scuffed. Okay, great. Oh, nope. Game audio is back. Yeah, one, two, three. Yeah, I know. Yeah, this is what happens every single time. I tell people to save one and to save two. It's just traditional stream. You know, stream behavior. Okay, um, audio is back. Okay, nice. Tonight. So my kind of thought is like, if it's a pipe paper, it's gonna trade, you know, what's the worst thing that could happen is really like, I don't know. Like, 
Okay, this is some amazing catch mechanic. Let's go. Very, very good. <laughs> We're going against all smashes. <laughs> this is great, though. Let's go. Okay, double freeze. Okay, nice. We, we went, you know, people just like to roll double freeze for some reason. What's the score? We're going 4-0 right now. Um, Arm wrestler. Wow. Yeah, freaking right, bro. So I'm just going to do this right here. Making sure we're actually not going to proc block right here by just doing this. You know, I'm, I'm just going to do this to make sure we don't proc block right here. Just to make sure we get that good trades right here. Because we're just going to, you know, Colonel pull this next turn. He's not going to immediately grow this right here. Um, if I'm not mistaken, like, what, what can he really do to just immediately grow this out of range by Colonel pull? Like, nothing. I don't think anything can. So this is really good right here. Overthinking ladder plays. Now I'm just, like, thinking of which one is optimal. So yeah, goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs> And see you later. And no, <laughs> get right. Five and zero. Oh. Too easy. And let's go. Oh god. Oh. All right. All right. Still fine. We can continue. <laughs> okay. Let's go. And let's continue. Oh yeah, so in the YouTube video, it's going to be perfectly fine. It's just on your, you know, side right now where it's being streamed that looks really bad. But I'm going to, because I'm recording simultaneously now, uh, as well. So yeah, this should be fine. So yeah. Um, so against Infinity right here, I'm just gonna like, mulligan one of my bananas. So this does not look a great hand right here. I'm just gonna mulligan my banana again. Try to look for some early game. Still not a great hand. Look for early game. Look for early game still. God damn. Okay, so at least we have a turn two swash counter, I guess. I don't know. But okay. <laughs> guys, swabby, swab, guys, swabby OP. Just dr swabby turn one. Don't even mess with swabby. T Bone is so proud of us now. <laughs> Come on, little buddy. Damn it, okay. <laughs> it's at least a little bit close to little buddy, you know? Close to being a little buddy right here. That's fine. Okay, has to. Okay, what is this? Is this like Hyper Swarm or something like this? Like, I don't know. I'm just gonna play this here because in case I need to protect this with my Rose Powers in case there's Infinity Clones right here. You know, just a little bit of a counter. Like, a little bit of a countermeasure. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. I'm just gonna find the catch up. Or we can block this. <laughs> like a skilled player, as per usual. RCC is just skilled at the game. You know, just casually block the fire damage from the haunting ghost right there. Just get, because we're just a skilled player, you know? We're just skilled at the game. You guys don't understand, you know? We're, we're just skilled, you know? Um, yeah, this is really freaking good. Let's go. Love these pepper MDs. Like these pepper MDs have been getting value every single game so far. Every single time we had them, they have been getting value. They have been getting a lot of value. Let's just say that. You know? Oh, swap guys. Swabby. Oh, OTK swabby. Let's go. <laughs> this guy is going for the OTK swabby. Swabby treat, guys. Greatest turn two play ever. Swabby treat. You know? It's how you play PvP heroes. <laughs> Don't even question it. Don't even question this guy. Totally not trying to do aerobics. Just, just do this. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look, look at my. Uh, we we got some skill going on here. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put ten bucks in this is Pogo. Yeah. See you later. Bet this is Pogo like a million times over. Oh, we can get Brianna next turn as well. Oh, that's pretty good actually. Oh, I should have done this. Whoops. Um. Yeah, schwips. Slight mistake. Um, so yeah, we should be fine right here. No, stream just died completely. Oh, great. Oh, this is great. Well, it's just dead. Well, it's completely dead once again. For some freaking reason. Nope, it's not dead. We're back. No, we're still here. It's not dead. I mean, I ain't dead. No, I'm literally right here. Okay, we're still in the middle of the stream. Yeah, we're still fine. This game's still going right here. 
can't encrypt the Swabby. Swabby too OP for this guy to mess with. Elderberry. That's pretty good. We got a couple. We got several ways of winning. You know, we got several ways of winning right here. You know, you don't need to question them. You like you got this. You know, we can do a little bit of this, and then we can just do a little bit of this as well. You know, we have this, and then we have this. You know, just, it's okay. It's just slight overkill. You know. Cause this is still fine. Um, yeah, the game's still recording regardless, so we're fine. All right, frozen. Okay, so we can actually stay alive right here, which is kind of monk this for us. I don't know. How do you feel about this right here? Nah, brain has gotta finish this guy off. Okay, he actually stayed alive. Okay, right. Wow, wow, skill player IMO. Oh, this is definitely gonna, gonna finish this. That, that's definitely gonna finish this guy off, right? There's nothing you can do. No, there's nothing you can do. No, it's guaranteed lethal. It's 6 and 0. <laughs> yeah, it's a 6 and 0. Clown hard. Yeah, gone. Too easy. <laughs> Alright, next. 6 0, let's go. Alright, I guess Neptuna right here, so we gotta try to look for our actual, you know, Gory Flakes right here. Um, Neptuna is usually typically a very great base hero. So, yeah. Uh, don't need these, I guess, that much. Okay, don't need this. Okay, don't need this. Okay, I, okay, whatever, let's just keep those, I guess. Alright. Free, so we're not gonna be using this right here. So nice, pass number one, it's fine. Oh, whoops, this is wrong mode, whoops. I'll go put on turn one, really annoying. Yeah, I'll go put on turn one, it's kind of monk at us for us. Um, let's see how it goes right here. Oh, I forgot we're skilled. I forgot we're skilled. We are perfectly skilled. At this game. Yeah, this is going pretty well so far. <laughs> they already have a 4 4 against the tuna on turn 2, which is, you know, just going you know, a little bit high roll. You know, a little bit of high roll. Let's just say it's a little bit of high roll. Um, let's go. It's nice. We're just gonna catch a mechanic right here. We're getting so much value. Um, we can also do this right here. Um, might be excavator. Oh no, it's probably smelly zombie actually. Oh no, it's probably smelly actually. I'm just gonna ignore it. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing smelly. If it's ma no, there's no way it's a flame phase. No, no, there's no way it's a flame phase, right? Exca. Oh, it, oh, it's the only thing I didn't consider. Whoops. <laughs> whoops. Sl yeah, sh whoops. That's misplay right there. Um, oopsies. Didn't consider excavator. California rolled. Okay, whatever, bro. Okay, he blows that, of course. Great. Okay, that's gone. Ah, oh, stuff, Colonel. So, interesting thing we can do right here. Oh, he picked the wrong deck. Picked the wrong deck, huh? Chance of this. Chance of this. Picked the wrong deck. That's fine. Just a little bit of that. Let's just catch up that. Nice. Doesn't have an answer against that, I guess. It doesn't have a healthy treat. Still very good. Um, let's go. So, I think we're just, um, going for double Ds. He's probably, okay, he's, this is probably surprise guard. No, no surprise guards, okay. So, no surprise guards, I'm just gonna do this then. Yeah, just ask for Kado because he can't answer it. Twitch doesn't see when he see you playing Rose because it clearly sucks. Okay, I don't know what's going on right here, but, like, seriously, like, I'm playing this game perfectly fine right now. Like, it's just... On Twitch's end right here, which is kind of like old Monka, I guess. You know, on, it's going haywire on Twitch's end. Oh, please pass. Pass, 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 pass. Come on, pass, 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 pass. Damn it. Um, that's close to being passing. <laughs> that's close to passing, honestly. Um, yeah. That's like close to being as throwing as a pass play, so. Yeah, I'll take that as like a pass. So, we are gonna do you, because this is. And I'm gonna go here and there. So we're gonna do this. 
Um, yeah, let's kill this right here. Well, this is guaranteed lethal, right? Close to. I think. <laughs> Very nice. It has an end play for us because... Damn, that was profit, you know? This is going pretty well. This is going pretty well. I like it. You know, this stream just died, like, I don't know, like, every single freaking few minutes. Anyways, um, keep the ads going. Keep the ads going. We got more ads to go. More ads. Okay, we still have 14 more ads. <laughs> so sign 213. Oh, welcome. Oh, that's 7 0, by the way. Yeah, this guy's in. 7 and no. Too easy. This guy's gone. Dude, what the heck is this? Yeah, there you go. Uh, reminder to self, please, like, cut <laughs> cut the waiting time between the games. It's kind of monk ass right now because of the little bit of lag, as we do, as we can see. And let's go. Yeah, the stream comes out like every single freaking few seconds. I don't know what the heck is this. Alright, Rose versus PBS. Okay, this is gonna be a rough matchup, you know? It's gonna be a rough matchup. Um, so we're gonna need to look for something right here. Um, yeah. Mulligan well, this against PBS. Let's try to look for something else. We don't need too many cop cannons. Kinda neat early game. It's fine. Alright. The Rose versus PBS, typically a very bad matchup. Um, Grave Robber on turn one. Might be Trick Stash, but who knows, you know? Might be Trick Stash, you know? It might be the latter Trick Stash right here. You, you don't know. You never know. You never know, bro. Christmas is hungry for Christmas. <laughs> Yo, chill. Yo, chill, chill, chill. Dude, okay, this is quite annoying. It's gonna be teleportation zombie, right? So if we get to teleportation, I just wanna mog it. Yeah, just, I guess teleportation is one of all I get. I'm gonna trade these two right here. Yeah, teleportation. Okay. He's probably actually gonna play around me mogging it though, so we can actually get catch a value if he plays it around. Okay, so if he actually plays around me, you know, mogging or go to find this right here, we're actually gonna get some catch value, so hopefully he tries to play around it and then completely fail. Um, mm, kinda jinxed it. Okay, this is not gonna be good. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's just say, let's just say this not this does not look good for us at all. <laughs> this looks pretty bad if you're asking me. He's got mustache waxer in the board. Yeah, this ain't going. This ain't going down very well right here. But we, he did fall for the debate right here, which means he do get this. Okay, great. Here we go. Here comes the trick sash, you know, intensifying. Great. Okay, here. Let's see what he gets. He's definitely gonna get something saves the TPC right here, like bet, you know? <laughs> like <laughs> like more than half of his power more than half the power save the teleportation zombie right here. Draw. Um was that his starting power? Okay, I don't know. Because I don't know. It didn't say contra by quasar. So it probably didn't get something that saves the teleportation zombie. I don't know if he would use it, I guess. Super light, yeah, I know. La the game's lagging right now, which is kinda monka. <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> Trick sash is just so broken, dude. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna need to do this then. Okay, yep, it's Trek Stash. <laughs> this is. This ain't going well, but. Let's try to do something right here. I don't know, this is. <laughs> We're very limited. Okay, wow, great. <laughs> Blue Glue saying, okay, wow. Okay, he got that. He got that. Okay, are you freaking kidding me? Okay, that's gone. Well, okay, bro. <laughs> Wow, such garbage. Okay, killing this right here. 
This is like hella aggression right here. Come on. Okay, we got some radishes right here, so we can get some make some block chargers right here, which, which I'm fine with. You know? Okay, it's probably teleportation zombie again. Okay, you. So bounces up. And do this. Another teleportation, of course. Final mission right here would be Monka S for us again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What, 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 what next? It's, what, what next right here? Like, <laughs> Trickster now? Like, what is next on the table right here? What, Trickster? Bet. <laughs> come on, just, just, come on, just finish me off with Trickster, come on. <laughs> show the world we can do it, you know, show the world we can do that. Why should she like a mustache or something like that? Okay, are you kidding? Okay, that is such gar- That is such garbage. Are you kidding? Okay. Bruh. Okay, somehow we mocked and it turned into something better. Wow, great. Okay, now okay, now we're gonna lose. <laughs> bruh. <laughs> this is very bra right now, let's just say that. Okay. Well, that's gone. Oh well, that's great. Um, let's do this. Because we can actually do all stuff right here. You can finally clear these things off the board. Hopefully he doesn't have like chop in or else we're screwed. I, mean, I don't know. We're staying at five health here. This is extremely uncomfortable. Um <laughs> Okay, so got a pretty juicy cop cannon, so I like it. I like it. I like the juicy cop. Let's go. To move everything. No, he didn't have anything. Okay, so he actually probably just not running any linking for some reason. Just running mustache surgery. This is why you need to run trickster. Sam, I don't know. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh, okay, bro. <laughs> well, that's gone. I mean, <laughs> that's as well as a you know, PBS vs. Bros game goes. I mean, that's this is how this is how it goes. You know, <laughs> that's just how it goes. Mustache Valk. All right, so um, stream has had seen like a very major like disconnect issue. Um. In like the past hour, so I'm gonna like finish the last two games off stream right here completely. I'm just gonna record it. Um, this will be uploaded to YouTube as soon as possible. Um, why am I even saying this? I don't know, but yes, with YouTube will be seeing this, um, very soon. Uh, so yeah, slay apologies for like lag right there. Yeah, this is another separate recording from the last uh, apology right there because the game you know died again, unfortunately. So you have to go again. All right. Um, now we should be fine. So now I think the stream should be completely fine. Um, so yeah, let's go. So a little promise of flower right here. This should be okay. A promise of flower right here. Okay. I can get with the smash stick on Prime with some flowers today. I don't know what the heck people are doing, but it's like, guys, Primal Sunflower is so dangerous. Just smash stick, guys. Smash stick, Primal Sunflower. I don't know what's wrong with people, but people just like smash stick, Primal Sunflower. The game, right? So he's gonna pepper trade that. Should be fine. Okay, let's just trade against that right here. Um, hopefully we can freeze this, I guess. Or we can get like a healing card right here. <laughs> like that. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Okay, what? That's play. So pepper right here and then do this and this. Very nice. So we got a very good play for next year, which is low bunny plus this. Amazing. Basically just makes it a 4-4 and then this comes a 5-4 as well. Really, really good use of low bunny, which I very much like. So nice. I'm gonna do this in front of this because I wanna protect it. And this kind of has more growth potential as well. So yeah, you protect it right here. Area 22 is completely fine. So we're doing 9 damage to face right here. It's going to freeze whatever he's going to put in there, usually. Um, so it looks like we're in very good shape right here. Because, especially with Brain Anna as well next turn. So we can just freeze whatever's in here and Brain Anna again next turn. So we're looking really fancy right here. And if you top like, like a Nelden or Elderberry, just instant GG's. Okay, he does that, which is completely fine, bros. So we're just going to freeze this, I guess. Try to draw a card right here now. That's an interesting decision. I don't know why we would not do this one. He kind of thinks we have more healing. We really don't. 
Oh, there's more healing. Okay, just concede it. Okay, so that's gonna, that's gonna do it for the predictions right there. And one. So, answer is yes. Congratulations to those who just got rich. And too bad for those who just went broke. <laughs> the outcome is yes, and more. Prediction results were yes. So we're gonna go on the last game right here. I'm really happy with how those like really performed because honestly, I thought the pepper empties were gonna be a little bit worse. But really, we've been getting consistent, you know, value like every single time right here. Like we've really just gotten consistent, you know, the pepper combo like every single game right here. Like we've gotten some form of healing with our pepper empty every single time we have gotten it. You know, it is really nice to have that you know kind of thing going on. Smoking this right here. We don't need too much peppers right here. Let's see. Okay, this is fine. Like, I really like this, like, heal package kind of idea. Just, you know, primal sunflower with pepper and D and, like, rescue radish and, you know, catch a mechanic and a little buddy. It just works so well with Rose because, um, you have just so many of these, like, cheap guys. Like, these El Cheapos. Okay, nice. So that's going to be a swashbuckler and a half. So see you next time. <laughs> Gotta love the swashbuckler. Gotta love the swashbuckler. The, you know, the young swashbuckler here, guys. <laughs> guys, I swear. Swashbuckler guitar, you know. Believe in pride. Okay, so we're gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. So if it's not playing face, it's gonna be sad. And his line dancer, also pretty sad. So let's see. <laughs> Pick your poison. <laughs> Which one do you want to deal with? So if he... Okay, preferably I wouldn't even go for the radish right here. Because then I can do like this, this, and this right here next turn. Which is amazing, you know. Come on. Damn it. Okay, he's smart. He, he got a little bit of a brain. He got a little bit of a brain. He's like, he's got, he's got to stop us from ramping. But we can get, like, maybe skilled and get an Astrocado from our, you know, top deck as well, which is possible. Okay, we don't get, we were not that skilled, but, you know, we're closely being that, that skilled at this point, you know? Let's just gonna do a little bit of a radish. Pepper, like, this is amazing. Pepper, we've got, like, pepper with an activator every single freaking, you know, every single freaking, like, game so far. That we have used Pepper MD in. We have gotten his activators, which is amazing, you know? It's nice. He got Deadly, which is completely fine. Like, that's not gonna do anything usually because we're not gonna be fronting it anyways. But we got, like, a <laughs> rescue radish to just pick this back up if we need to use it again. Ever. Um, so we actually just do this, this, and this one. Holy crap, this is why it's so strong, guys. So we're gonna do this. So we're gonna kill this. Then we're gonna do this. And we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna front right here. Very nice. He's gonna need to bounce it again. <laughs> he's just about look, he's just bouncing a two drop here. Like what is he really bouncing? He's really just bouncing two drops and we're getting like these free fours on the board right here. So strong. He's gonna do Vatras trying to desperately try to get like a mug off here. Do you get any tempo to win the game? Possibly. Like not even close because that's that now. Like right. Like this guy might also just concede at this point. Like he doesn't have a damn thing right here. He doesn't have a damn right here. <laughs> just bring Anna, just, just like, you know, just finish this guy off. <laughs> you know, just bring Anna, just extra stall right here. Yeah, bring Anna's probably gonna seal this, seal this game off right here, pretty much. Like, with his board state. Okay, he does a couple of things right there, which is okay, so I'm gonna do you now. And then I'm gonna proc block the main one. So do this. Strike through, and... <laughs> Just playing a couple of lane phases, like this is so sad for him. Like, oh no, it's guaranteed lethal. <laughs> That's it, guys. Nine and one. I mean, deck did pretty amazing, except for against like the Professor Brainstorm, like the Trickstat starter. You know, it didn't really well until winning against Trickstat, which was you know, I kind of expected the previous control matchup was gonna get kick our ass. But I'm really happy with really like how this went. Like honestly, over how this went. It just really showed me, like, how consistent can we really get the pepper combos to be, you know? You know, a takeaway I'm taking away from this is not that ladder players suck and that this deck is amazing, but, you know, the consistency of the pepper is there, you know? We can't run the pepper, you know? It's there, you know? <laughs> and it's fine, and it works, you know? And it's kind of the thing I like is that the pepper MD does work right here in this deck, especially the, like, the rest strategies. I think, you know, the... Four rescue addresses were superb. Uh, honestly, like Primal Sunflower, Pepper MD, like Catch a Mechanic, you know, Rescue Radish, and the Little Buddy, they were all very superb in like what they were like doing the deck. Like I felt like every single card was contributing towards the game plan right here. You know? 
like, we're really building up this really heavy tempo in a ward with the Pepper MDs, and, you know, just following up with more Strifers, and, they, and it, they can't just answer it, you know? And it felt, like, so strong there, you know? And it felt so good to have this really strong early game shells and, you know, move on to, like, a very heavy late game, you know, kind of deck, because you have so many late game cards lately, you know? Elderberry, we have Astrocado, Brain Anna, and Cobb Cannon in the same deck. You know, we have all these linking cards that help us, you know, push damage through, which I kind of really like right there. Which is kind of a thing I really like about this deck is that it just has a lot of linking while being a really solid early game as well. You know, that Primal Sun the Primal Sunflower Radish, you know, kind of idea really, you know, is re a really, you know, good idea. And I kind of want to say this is already pretty optimal, you know. I, I don't really know what I'm going to complain about this, like, like, you know, like, we lost against Trick Statue, and that's maybe it, like, you know? Otherwise, everything in the deck really just came together as a whole to contribute towards the gameplay, which I really like. And we, and the Pepper MDs have been amazing. We've gotten, you know, an activator for every single freaking game. Every single game we got Pepper MD, we have gotten an activator for it. Like, either we're very, very lucky, or just, you know, <laughs> or it's really that, just that consistent, you know? To a certain degree, I think you could say it's consistent enough for us to run Pepper MD, and it'd be worth it, because, like, the idea of just, you know, not fencing your opponent's turn one, just going prime with Sunflower and letting your, your face and just, you know, Pepper at Bunny in extern, or just go Radish Bunny, it's amazing, you know, I love it. Very, very good deck with Rose, um, <laughs> definitely happy with this deck, um, hopefully I can optimize this a little bit more, uh, but... Hopefully we should, you know, see a little bit of improvement from like, the previous room sex like Rant Midrows, which were, you know, on average pretty crappy against like the Gravestone matchups. So yeah, I'm very happy with this deck. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have a great time. Um, peace out. Very, very good deck. Hope probably the best Rose deck in the game right now, as I said in the previous video, uh, which by the time this video gets released, then you probably would have seen the last video already, which would have been the best decks of 2021, which would be released on Christmas. So yeah. Merry Christmas to all of you guys, because I'm streaming this on Christmas right now. Uh, it is currently, currently the 25th of December. Thanks for watching, guys, and hope to see you guys next time, and bye-bye.